Hello developers, welcome back to our channel. Today we've got an exciting topic for you. We'll show you how to implement IP Stack, an IP geolocation API that provides accurate location information for your website visitors in real time. So, what exactly is IP Stack and why should you consider using it? Well, IP Stack is your go to solution when you want to retrieve location information for your website visitors. It's quick and hassle-free, allowing you to obtain data in either JSON or XML format, making it easy to review and process. Now, let's jump into the implementation process. The first step is to sign up for an account on the IPStack website. Once registered, you'll receive an API key, your ticket to accessing the IPStack API. Before diving further, you must decide which data format suits you best. IPStack offers two options, JSON and XML. You can choose the one that aligns with your preferences. The best part about IPStack is its easy implementation. In under 10 minutes, you can have it up and running. Just keep two key factors in mind. First, select the programming language you want to use. Second, Consult the comprehensive IP Stack API documentation and quick start guide to start quickly. IP Stack supports many programming languages, including Python, PHP, Ruby, and more. The extensive documentation provides a complete reference for experimenters with overview walkthroughs, source code explanations, and examples. Once you've implemented IP Stack, you can locate and identify website visitors by IP address. IP Stack's infrastructure is built with a scalability and ease of use, so you can make anywhere from a thousand requests a month to a million requests daily. Unique selling points. IP Stack's unique selling points include easy implementation. Setting up IP Stack in less than 10 minutes is a game changer for businesses. Rich documentation. Their detailed API documentation and quick start guide are treasure trove for information for developers. High performance. Performance matters and IP Stack caters to diverse requirements from a thousand to a million daily requests. Competitive pricing. IP Stack offers various pricing options, including a free plan. Using the IP Stack with Flask to fetch a website visitor's location. While this guide focuses on Python, the IP Stack API can be integrated with any program language you choose. You can refer to the official IP Stack documentation for specific details and guidance on using the API with other languages. All right, let's break it down step by step. Step one, download and install Python. Go to the official Python website download page and download the version suitable for your operating system. Step two, register an IP stack for API key. Let's show you how to get an API key. Now, let's show you how to obtain your API key. Simply visit the IP Stack website, click on the Get Free API Key button on the right top corner, and fill out the required details. If you already have an account, just log in. You'll find your API access key in your dashboard. Step 3. Set up the project environment. Setting up your project environment involves creating a new directory, opening it in a code editor, and setting up a virtual environment. Activation of the virtual environment may vary depending on your operating system. Step 4. Install Flask in the in virtual environment. To install the Flask in the virtual environment, we need to run the command pip install flask requests in the terminal, then press enter. As you can see on the screen, we already have Flask installed in our system. Step 5. Create the Flask application APPPY. In the fifth step, we have to create a Flask application in Python. As you can see on the screen, the application is created. Let's explore its structure at the top. We have imported Flask. 
then we imported requests, and then we created a Flask function and set the rule to IP stack. This route will serve our application. Here you have to add the API key, and here is the endpoint that we got from IP stack. Then there is the function to get data response in our preferred format. And finally, we have to render the HTML file that we will create in the next step. Step 6. Create the HTML template. As mentioned in our previous section, we must create this HTML template. Let's explore it here. This is a very basic HTML structure. We can also add our styles to it and then the script will fetch the location, details or IP details. You can also add more elements at this point. Step 7. Run the Flask application. To run your Flask application, use the simple Python command, Python APPPY. You'll receive the URL where your application is serving. Access it and check out the IP details. But that's not all. IP stack opens up a world of possibilities. Let's explore them. Expanding possibilities, leveraging IP stack for diverse applications. IP stack comes with a large variety of applications. Some of them are enhanced user experience, improved security, optimized marketing, enhanced e-commerce, customized user interface. So, what are you waiting for developers? Sign up for a free trial at IP Stack today and unlock the potential of accurate IP geolocation data for your website.